Okay, a wonderful gardening trend is gardening in small spaces. So you don't need to have a gigantic whiskey barrel or huge hanging baskets to really enjoy the beauty of growing annuals and perennials. So this pot is a little bigger than a two gallon and it's kind of a nice decorative container. And so I'm gonna choose plants that go in this pot and just pretend you're like an artist, you're a designer, and you have fun choosing plants that you think will match the container. This is a proven winner's hookera, and it's called leapfrog. So I'm gonna choose this as my main focal point plant. And let me show you something that I do when I have a, a plant like this that is that's kind of new and interesting, is take the plant tag, and I wanna remember what this plant is, and this is a perennial because it is a hookah so it'll come back every year. I'm gonna slide it way down here so I don't have to see it. So I'll know to pull it out if I wanna see what that was that I purchased. Now, because that has you know kind of the, the more russet and orange tones, then I like this. This is a very small petunia called a calabrocaea. These are perfect for a smaller pot, and I'm gonna put these near the edge of the pot so they can spill over. Now I'm using some slow-release Osmocote fertilizer and it comes with a cap that measures perfectly the amount for about a two gallon pot. So I just sprinkle this all into the soil. And now I continue adding my plants. And this is another Calabrocaea petunia hybrid. And now that looks like it's probably full enough, but just because I've got some room here and I want lots of color, I'm gonna add this sweet potato vine. So there, with just four plants in a two gallon pot, and staying with one color family, the lime green, the oranges, and the russets, and choosing a pot that's kind of in that same color family, very short amount of time, we've got a great container garden for a small space.